Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function. Here after I have taken auto integer variable main one and main two. So next to uh, integer tab variable, I have taken array. So I at the I have given 25 uh, signs. So maximum you can enter 25 elements into the array. So if you want to add more elements, then increase the size. And here after uh, two more variables n and i. So I add here this is a double r size. I have given 25 and n and i so next is printer function slash and then cursor comes to the new line and whatever in double code so that display into the output screen enter the size of array so whatever i'm going to enter so that received by n so i'm going to enter n value 5 And here after control comes to this point or oh, printer enter percent d percent d because n is integer tab so I enter this display enter seven elements and here after control comes to follow now i will start from zero and check the condition zero less than n value i given five so 0 less than 5 condition is true. So control comes to a scanner or function and uh, add here. Let's enter a dollar 0 percent new elements. So this is array. This is 0 percent 1. Two, three, four. So eight or zero person. I'm going to enter nine. And here after that, go up and increase the value of i. So i become zero to one. Check the condition one less than five. Condition is true. So let's enter eight or one person new element. So I enter eleven. I is increased by one again. So i is two now. Check the condition two less than five. Condition is true. So it over two position, let's enter new elements. So I enter 13. Now here after i is uh, 3. Or oh, check the condition 3 less than 5 condition is true. So I enter it over 3 position, let's enter new elements. So I enter 25. Again, that increase the value of i. So i become 3 to 4. Check the condition 4 less than 5 condition is true. So that coincide. So I enter, let's enter it over 4 position element. Seven. Now add here. Add here or uh, check the condition a dollar zero position greater less than a dollar one. So zero position is nine and uh, less than eleven. So the condition is true. So that coincide. So a dollar zero position value go to mean. So zero position is nine. Nine go to mean one. And at here, it will one person value go to main two. Now, if condition is true, so that not go to the else part. So here after control comes to this point, I value start from two. And at here, check the condition if it will all i less than mean one. So one person is oh, i value is one. Sorry, i value is two. So two position less than mean one. Two position is thirteen less than mean one value is or oh, nine. The condition is not true, so that not go to else part or uh, if part. So control comes to else part. So at a it or two position thirteen less than mean two. So thirteen less than mean two value is. Or mean to 11. So this condition is also not true. So that go up and increase the value of i. So i become 2 to 3. Check the condition 3 less than n. 
n value I have given 5. So 3 less than 5, condition is true. So at here, check the condition. If a to power 3 person less than mean. So 3 person is 25. 25 less than 11. Oh sorry, mean 1. So 25 less than uh, 9. Condition is not true. That not go to if what? Else if. So a to power 3 person less than mean 2. So 25 less than 11. Condition is also not true. So that not coincide. Here after i is so increased by 1. So i is 4 now. Check the condition for less than 5. Condition is true. So I do have 4 position less than mean 1. So 4 position is so uh, 7. And mean 1 value is 9. So this condition is true. So mean 1 value go to mean 2. So 9 go to mean 2. And I do have 4 position value go to mean 1. So 7 go to mean 1. So if condition is true, that not go to else part. Else if part here after that go up and increase the value of i. So i become 5 now. So check the condition. 5 less than 5 condition is not true. So control comes to this point. Also add here this display. The smallest number is percentage because mean 1 is integer. So at a uh, display, the smallest element is mean 1. So mean 1 value, that is plus 7. And uh, second uh, smallest element is mean 2. Mean 2 value is 9, that is plus. And here after, that out for main function. So at here, uh, I enter 4 elements. Or you can increase the uh, number of elements to 25. Because the size I have given 25. And uh, just to try to enter another number like so 6, 7, 3, 2, 23, 21 and or do the same process or try it in. So you will get uh, expected output. So this is the giant method of this program. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So thanks for watching. See you next week.